Hey everybody, Queen Richard here, and I am here with a different kind of review video. It's not a toy or a doll. Um, I love toys and dolls, don't get me wrong, but I have a whole lot of other loves. My husband, my dogs, uh, also I love music, I collect a lot of music, but I also have a love for shoes. And this is a review of one of my very favorite designers, John Fluvog. And I recently went on a little bit of a binge and bought a bunch of shoes. Um, I even over very, very bad, but they're an investment. And, um, <laughs> and I just love these to death. And I just wanted to kind of show them to all of you because I'm sure there's some of you who are really into shoes too. But anyway, um, we'll go ahead and get started. I wanted to get, go ahead and get started first with the box. Um, so this is one of the boxes, but I just wanted to show you everyone the inside of the box because it's a real, it's always, it's always this picture and I just think this is just such a cool picture. All the shoes there. I think they're just a really neat couple. So blue box shoes are really interesting. There's lots of different styles. Some of them are very whimsical. Um, I'll go ahead and leave a link to their website down below. Um, but some of their shoes are very whimsical. Some of them are very gothic, you know, quote unquote. Um, some of them are, you know, very military looking. Um, just all sorts of different looks. So these ones are called the Alex. And um, I have a few pairs that are kind of like, a few other pairs that are kind of like this. Maybe once I get, because I, I have a bunch of other pairs. Maybe once I get them resold, maybe I'll review them as well. Uh, but these, I just adore these. Beautiful green shoes. I love the color green. And as you can kind of tell, they're, the tips are a bit of a darker shade. And they look a bit worn because I've actually been wearing them a bit, trying to get them broken in. And here is the signature em embossed on the side. Very nice touch. And also this little black band that's here. And they're rubber sold. So they're good with, you know, dress pants and with jeans. They came with black shoelaces and they also came with green shoelaces as well if I wanted to trade them out. Now these ones are called the Garricks. Now this is the Swordfish family. That's the thing. Well, with Blue Logs, there's all sorts of different kinds of families. There's swordfish, there's angels, a few different kind of angels. Um, but these are swordfish, meaning like the swordfish tip shoe, so they're a bit severe. Now, just so you know, my toes come up to about here. So it's not like my toes are like in this little point. You know, this is just all kind of fluff, per se. Um, but it's a Quite, it's quite a little structural thing here to wear these shoes. Um, but it squares off at the tip, and then it comes out a little way, almost like fins. And now the, the watchful eye will know that this is kind of like an 80s style shoe. Um, back, back in the day, that was kind of the thing with the slip-on shoe with the elastic here. They're very tailored in the side. I love how it just kind of goes like a wave. And here's the toe. And what's really great about these is it comes up and down. And that's a little angel. And here, is the bottom of the shoe. I just love these. But, that being said, they're not my favorite of this trio. These are. These are the Lestats. I am trying desperately to get these broken in and for next Friday when I go dancing. Um, 
another swordfish tip, only they don't come around the sides. Now, as you can see, these are two different kinds of leather. Leather. <clears throat> we have the shiny leather on the top, and it's almost like it's engulfed in this brushed leather. It almost looks like the shoe like the, like the penguin would wear, in my opinion. I love these little hooks. Very, very shiny silver. One reason why these have been a little hard to break in is because they are just so tailored. There's like the seam that goes all the way around. There's not a whole lot of support back here. So it's been a little difficult to get these broken in. But I'm still trying. And the big cucamonga is the heel. Stainless steel heel. And it's like a brushed stainless steel. Just gorgeous. And here's the bottom. But it's a little scut since, you know, I've been trying to break them in. So these are my three latest pairs of shoes. I give them all 10 stars out of five, <laughs> just because I love shoes. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe down below. Thank you so much for watching. Boo!